Self-driving vehicles have moved beyond headlines and concept design to become a reality on Taiwan's road. Smart shuttles now navigate fixed routes using AI, high-resolution maps, and real-time sensors. But what happens when someone unexpectedly steps in front of these autonomous vehicles? The system detected a pedestrian standing in the middle of the road, so the self-driving car stopped automatically. LiDAR hacks at the car's eyes, sensing obstacles in all directions. Human attendants remain on board these vehicles, but they are primarily there as a safety precaution. The sophisticated systems can already handle braking, obstacle detection, and real-time traffic responses on their own. For the public, self-driving cars offer a fun and easy ride. For operators, it means safer transit, since the safety staff can replace a full-time driver. On slow, small shuttles, no driver may even be needed, reducing fatigue and improving efficiency. Beyond convenience, these autonomous vehicles offer a practical solution to Taiwan's growing labor shortage. The slow-moving vehicle ahead, so you can feel it braking gently. If the driver falls asleep, it keeps alerting them, and if there's no response, the bus will safely stop on its own. AI AI works in three key ways. First is perception, using cameras and radar data to understand the surroundings. Second is decision making, the brain that figures out how to steer or avoid obstacles. Third is control, managing the wheel, brakes, and throttle. Why develop self driving tech? Because industries like the IC sector demand it. Taiwan's automotive electronics sector is booming, worth nearly half a trillion new Taiwan dollars this year, and expected to almost double by 2028. But leveraging its tech expertise and 5G network, Taiwan isn't just joining the AI power mobility revolution, it's helping lead the way. Xie Yilun, Neil Chen, Simon Lu, TVBS World Taiwan.